Well, good morning, everyone. I'm Janice McGeehan, your Lieutenant Governor, and I just would like to welcome all of you to our beautiful capital. Idaho's new Lieutenant Governor, Janice McGeehan, is welcoming the six finalists for the annual speech contest of the Idaho Farm Bureau Women's Leadership Committee. I appreciate that you um, have made the time to come here and work to develop your leadership skills. It's so important that the people of Idaho no matter which industry you come from, come to our capital and be engaged in the process of state government. Each February, leaders of tomorrow convene at the Idaho Capitol to compete in public speaking, a learning skill that Judge Brad Griff says is very useful in life. I thought the speeches were great. I thought you had really good content, good presentation. These are skills that will continue with you for the rest of your career, no matter what you do. Katie Hedega, my yeah, Santa Rita. Right. Yes. <laughs> And she's from District 4. Katie Hedinga, a senior at CUNA High School and FFA member, was today's winner. Public speaking is important to Katie, who already has the future in focus. I plan this fall on going to the University of Idaho, majoring in agriculture economics. And from there, I want to go on to law school to be a lawyer. And then I plan on running for the United States House of Representatives by the time I'm 28. I think that politics is a great way that I can use my public speaking skills that I've learned through FFA and through speech contests like this. Building leaders, one of the many objectives of the Idaho Farm Bureau. For the Voice of Idaho Agriculture, I'm Steve Ritter.